Let's go ahead and use Playful. If this is a heads, I'm good. If it didn't, just give me a heads. Yes, one heads. Yes! 420 damage right back at your face! Oh, yeah, you're going stronger than my 300 damage attack. Yes! Yes! Yes, Charizard, you're sexy today! You are. Well, hello, Nicholas, and the Frenchers. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. Man, on the next menu, I'll be serving you Charizard GX. GX Pokemon with the largest stats out of all the GX cards. Oh yeah, hit points, 250. Damage, 300. Oh. Pretty much there's no cards that exist that has these big numbers. But with big numbers, damage comes with a big cost. Five energy costs. Ouch. I bet, uh, yeah. This is going to be a very tough card to play. So, what if I told you, though? It's actually not. What if I said there was a cheaper, better attack that it can use that does more than 300 damage and more liable? I'm going to get to that. So, I'm going to explain to you how this Charizard GX deck works, and you're going to see it in three. Three, three awesome matches for you. First match really showcases all the Charizard can do. Second match is a little funny move with the situation with the GX attacks, which you definitely don't want to miss. And the last Dark Rivers Charizard, Fire Star, who comes out on top? You're going to find out. So let's get started. This month's intro is still alive from Portal. Oh yeah, you got to check out how Glado sings it though. Now, Charizard GX, let's talk about you. You are... A throwback or an evolution to past Charizards because there's a lot of the previous Charizards in this new one. So, 250 hit points, that's the first thing we talk about. Stage 2, you gotta go from Charmander to Charmeleon to Charizard. Full evolution, and you're getting the best hit points in the game. So, totally worth it. You deserve it. Okay, we're moving on. Wing attack. Sounds familiar, doesn't it? It should because it's learned it when it was the Charizard GX. Now it's a GX that did 60 damage. This does 70 damage. A very slight, slight upgrade. However, you give it a choice, man, it actually increases to 100 damage on GX Pokemons, which is enough to two shot a Lele. Good enough. Lele is, will have some trouble getting a Charizard, so two shot on a basic GX? All right, we can work with that. Moving on. It is kind of low. But with help, it works. Next attack is a throwback to what its Mega Pokemon did. 300 damage, 5 energy cost. Does that sound familiar? Yeah, it should because Charizard EX, Mega Charizard EX, that's 300 damage. However, it also hurt it itself. 50. The penalty is a bit different. It is a very fire penalty. 3 energies discarded. 3 energies. So if you're putting 3 energies per turn, it's gonna, well, take three turns for you to do it. And it only five energy counts. No DCs. Yeah, so maybe with burning energies, those were lower the cost. But I'm not going for this move as my main, main move set. I can, I'm gonna do something else. Because like I said at the start, there's a cheaper, stronger attack. In order to do it, you have to use try the memories, which allows evolved Pokemon to use the previous evolution's attack. And it used to be, previously, a Charmander. Where? This is the Generations Charmander. It can use Playful. You flip a coin. If heads, all damage on Charizard GX is doubled against the enemy. Ah. So as a Charmander, it's Stinks. Only 70 damage as a Charizard GX. You got a lot of hit points to work with. This can hit over 400 damage, which you will see. You probably saw it at the start of the video. So, we're gonna make those coin flips a little bit more secure with Victory Star. Victory ability! Pokemon that sits on your bench and makes your coin flips better. You get two coin flips. If one is heads, Great! That means it's a heads, and this really makes it more viable. So, it will do more damage for less energies. And hey, your Charizard's gonna get hurt, so... That's this real trick. It's really a Tauros. 
So that's how it's gonna work. Also, the final attack, Drage Out GX, discards Mills, tens cards off your opponent's X. And you're gonna see with deck digits these days, your opponent will use lots of cards, and this is just gonna make it hurt. I mean, they may, you may throw cards they may need, trainers, energies. It hurts. Losing cards that you could, you could have played hurts. And the mill out, if you have no cards in your deck, you automatically win, which is something that you may see. So, Charizard GX, well, that's actually fresh for you. You, these may, all these are old Charizard moves, but this is a fresh one. So, uh, he's learning new tricks now. Moving on, Charizard is the main star of the deck. Everybody has a bit of a supporter, so the only other two cards kind of show up in most decks because they're very nice to make card flows. You know, card, you know, your cards. Get you the card you want. Coconut Master, Tapu Lele, Wonder Tag, any supporter you like. We're just gonna bring out Kiawe. Kiawe, four fire energies onto one Pokemon. Only one. But your turn ends. Kinda, well, it's four energies. This is a very good payoff for Kiawe. So, that is, you know, I have one Kiawe. How are you gonna get it out? Tapu Lele, which is one. We have three Coconut Masters here. Banana Master. I don't know if this video or the next one. But in many videos, the extra draw from Instruct is a game changer. It's a winner. You're going all my decks now. Unless I have Sushi Master. Before bananas are just okay. So those are all the Pokemons. Those are all the major decks. The rest is part of the new standard deck engine, which I'll make a video about. So this is it. the abbreviated walkthrough of how the Charizard deck works. I'll put my like deck list link in the description. And that is it. Now, Charizard. You really want to see how this plays out? Here we go. Best matches you're gonna see. Yeah. yeah. We are gonna go and see what starts up front. El Tapu Lele starts up front. Not so good, but it's okay. It is okay. Lele can fight with the Choice Man and the DCE, so it's absolutely okay. Yeah, that's what it is. We see Tapu Lele as well. However, the other no, I get the first attack, so that that may be, that may work into my favor. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we cannot keep hearing this remix. This is for another another match. I want to play battle against a true hero. There we go. Battle against a true hero from Undertale. It's in the genocide mode. Doesn't that sound? Battle against a true. Doesn't that sound? No. no uh, Undertale is a pretty cool story. Moving on. Dolls re ripping for H E B. Oh shoot, you saw my HP. I used to work for HB and I still wear the t shirts. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's that. Hmm, a little bit of accident there. Yeah. One of my co workers see, see me now. Alright, starting with Bridget. That's the exact same card I wanted to start. That's what I want to see. So, oh my gosh, that's caught me off guard. That has caught me off guard. Alright, let's get both of these uh, up. Thank you for the follow. Nick PNN, as well as the Knight is full of terror. That's creeping me out. I hope my Knight's not full of terror. Oh, wow, look, it's Gardevoir! Charizard's gonna get wrecked by this if you actually get all three energies up. So, hey, Charizard, choice bad. PC definitely gonna go on you right now. Dude, I could end. I could end. Do you want to end? Not really. I'd rather get Layla and Bridget down. That's much modern to do, isn't it? Yeah. Let me see what is available. Bridget, Lele is there. Bridget is available, and that is probably the best move to do. So, I'm not going to give you any free cards. Let's go ahead and Lele ourselves. We're going to just copy each other. L Bridget, there we go. Alright, righty then. So, it, the, um, the, what's bad is the, the card of war is going to get one shot out of me, which is not good. So, we're going to pull out Victini, Orangaroo, Charmander. All the important cards that we need. Well, two Lele shouldn't be there, but that's okay. I also get two free cards, which is nice. DC again. So, energy drive. Take this. It's probably a three shot. 70 damage. If you put the DC on, it is going to be uh, probably enough. 70. Yeah, it's going to be enough to get the one shot. However, when God of War comes out, it's going to one shot me back. And I lose everything. The whole ship sinks. And I don't know about that. Is it worth it to play the DC to do that? Or is it worth it to get the Charizard up? Probably the Charizard. Probably the Charizard. It only needs two energies, and we we're banking really, really hard for stuff. Verse Seeker, man, make a new card of War deck, man. You can't, it was more weak. You cannot play Verse Seeker. Thank you for the follow, Primal Sept, Warlord, Mr. Awesome0904. Hey, Mr. Star of the Stream says Ark Wanted. Which decks have you done so far? I have done. <laughs> I've done Dark Ride GX and God of War GX. Those are the decks I've done. All right, so we got this right here. I could play an expensive retreat if I really, really wanted to. 
I could end right now, which would probably do something bad. But is it time to play your very special field, one single field blow? Probably not. However, it's okay. I'm gonna go remove this right now. I could retreat and start attacking. Let's do that. Let's get risky. Let's get risky. I want to get my first two prize cards. It is worth it to get those two prize cards. It's not what I needed. However, you're stuck on cards. I'm going to punish you for that. Let's go ahead and shot instead. And I do get the Shrine of Memories and the Charizard GX up. If I can, once I'm able to retreat this, like, with your boy, Guzma, it's going to be good. So, i maybe follow up with that and start up with my first Charizard. Uh-oh, one Curlia is up, and he is stuck. Ah, oh, ha ha, Shana has worked out for me. Charizard GX, you're now up. And you probably need to start charging you up now. Let's go ahead and play your boy, Guzma. Play, get that, get that guard arm out of here before it evolves. All right, so I could play the stadium. No, I'm not gonna play the stadium. So let's use energy drive, finish this off. Super powerful Tapu Lele, taking Charizard GX's place. Which I'm gonna need a lot of energies to charge you up, but which we'll, we'll get pretty soon. We have a Kiawe somewhere. Yeah, he always in this. I have no more vegetable space though, because I use stuff to get this guy charged up. End of the turn, you're still stuck. Ah, ha, 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 ha. I'm not gonna help you out, buddy. I am not gonna help you out. Before I stick more of the cards away, which I'll stick more for more, more cards, because I'm a greedy jerk. I'm a greedy jerk. Let's go ahead and do this. And I get another one shot on you. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, rare candy. Do we need this many Charizard GXs? Probably not. Probably not. I have a Kiawe. I might just do that for fun. I may just do that for fun. Here, you have an energy. Who needs a float zone? I'm not sure. You have a big retreat. No, you don't. Put this up to Vic Denny. Let's go and use energy drive. Another prize card. Three prize cards. I'm already halfway to victory. He's still not set up. He's unfortunately uh, stuck. What do you have here? Verse Seeker, Bridget, Lele. Another Lele goes out. This is okay. I mean, if you, uh, if I get the Charizard GX normally up, that's fine too. I could straight attack. Uh-oh, two energies. I would probably start attacking. I could just key away, give him a chance. I'm a greedy jerk, so I'm gonna key away. One, two, three, four, five energies. That's five, right? You will get four energies. One. Oh, they all have to go in one Pokemon? Yes, they all have to go into one Pokemon. You have six energies now. Are you happy, Charizard? And this means you will get one shot by God of War GX when it shows up. So we need to fry that card the minute it shows up. You hear me? You know, you are a dead weight. To, you're dead to me. So, okay, Charizard GX is up. I'm halfway to victory. This is good. If, you know, things start lining up for him, we are going to be really, really scared. He's going to retreat, send that out. He's like, no, I do not want to send a... I don't want that to be out there. All right, that makes sense. All right, we have a Charmeleon, but apparently all Charizards are up. That's convenient for me. All right, Lele Master, you are up. You know what? This is a... I will pull you out. Let's send out Charizard GX. Hey, buddy, have some fun. You have a free retreat. Here we go, in case I kill one, I use you. I could rage out GX just for fun, or I could blow you up. I'm gonna use rage out. Let's have some... We're never gonna see a GX attack, so let's go ahead and do that. Rage out! So many cards discarded. We got lots of curly as all the Ralts. That's the last Ralts in your deck. Deancey is here, too. So, oh, man. Rare Candy, the first guard of our up. Uh-oh. That's a one-shot if he retreats that. That is a straight one-shot. Uh-uh. You're out of here, guard of Charizard. You are out of here. You hear me? Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay. You see me getting scared? That's a one-shot. If something one-shot to make a Charizard, you definitely got to be afraid of that. Am I gonna end? No, you're stuck. I better keep you stuck. I'm gonna pull one more card down. It's a rare candy. We are gonna. It's not a one shot if I, uh, you know, use most of my cards up. So let's use Crimson Storm. Crimson Storm. Everything to take out. This should have been for the Mega God of War, except we can't pull it out. So that's all we can do. Hey, stuff. I do not need an end right now. You need to end right now. So God of War is gonna come out. It's like, what happened to all your energies? If he's got a DCE. That's still okay. I'm a Becca Charizard. I still get to live. This is gonna be okay. So, this is good. This is good. Alright, so, go back and Gardevoir comes up. Sushi Master is up. Oh, you're never gonna be stuck on cards now. You were really, really stuck, so... A lot of my opponents have been... Uh, that's been happening a lot today. Don't know what to do with yourself, says Jack Maul. Huh? Huh? Oh, can you make a video creating decent decks with default cards? Default cards? Ah, that's gonna be tough. However, with the new Ninetales, it should be good. It should be good. Maybe we'll do a special Ninetales video in the future. 
Yeah, actually that sounds like a good idea. Charizard, cars, lots of power for a dumb cost. Exactly right, Dr. Dog. Thank you for the follow, Ferg Hawk. All right, then. He's like, how many energies I need to one-shot? You're not going for a one-shot, buddy. And if I do get a DC in my hand, that card's dead. If actually, I don't need a DC in my hand. Oh, that's a one-shot. That is a one-shot. In no, I'm still alive! But I can still one-shot you back. If I get I'd rather get a DCE, though. I'd rather get the DCE and be make it secure. However, let's do this. Here, have a fresh two hand. I am desperate for that DCE. That has some fire energy. That is not what you need, man. I, You know, I want the DCE. That counts, so I'm going to have to play this. I'm not getting the DCE. All right. Our plan B is going to be a Charizard. Our plan B is a Charizard. Let's go ahead and use Playful. If this is a Heads, I'm good. If it didn't, just give me a Heads. Yes, one Heads. Yes! 420 damage right back at your face! Oh, yeah, you're even stronger than my 300 damage attack. Yes! Yes! Yes, Charizard, you're sexy today! He was, you see, um, I was messing around. I used a GX attack just for the heck of it. I, uh, I did the 300 damage attack just for the heck of it too. No, no, I was just trying to shrink my energy costs, preventing me from getting the one shot. My opponent was stuck. And we got to see the whole shebang out of Charizard. Like, this is the absolute perfect showcase match for Charizard. Alrighty then. Welcome to another Charizard GX match. I'm going to play my remix of Catch the Moment from Sword on the Lines Ordinal Scale movie. Now, what are you I'm going against here? Am I going against fighting? It looks like fighting. So if it's not water, then you know, I'm weak to water. I don't like water. By the way, this kid's probably gonna have a rough day if he can't see without his glasses, wouldn't he? Because I have very bad vision without my contacts. Yeah, so hopefully he gets his glasses back. Alright, choose Pokemon to bench? No, not that Pokemon, of course. Is Rock Ruff gonna be a threat? I probably will, but... You wanna open up with Kiawe right now, Donald? I don't really mind. I don't mind. But I don't know if I wanna risk it right now. We're gonna play it safe. I'm, instead of using Kiawe right now, right here, let's go ahead and open up with Bridget. Actually, this is the first look into my deck. Kiawe is here, but not Bridget. Well, that changes things. All right, in that case, I'll toss away the Lily and the Shana. Two draw supporters. Yes! What are we going to do now? We need, uh, we actually need plenty of cards, but the card I want right now is I don't want to trust, I don't trust the first Charmander. So that's why I'm going to get the back Charmander. And you know what? Let's get, uh, let's get the Lele up. I think Lele is going to be useful to fight with. And I will key away the back Charmander. My turn ends with this. So, let's go ahead and get the back one up. You don't want to trust the front one? No, I do not. Let's get this up here. Now we just need a rare candy, which maybe you want to save the lily. Then you just had to pull a rare candy. It is okay. I get the first turn. I don't see a big threat coming out right now, so let's just leave be. Alrighty then. Alright, now. At Dark Griddle Grew Gaming, Rook Spin789 says, How are you doing? I'm doing okay today. How are you, man? Alright, thank you for the follow. C Iris, Lays15, for Mandrix. Okay. Now, my, oh, oh, that's a very small turn for him. Okay, so what is this? I know the Lycan Rock gets really strong if I get spill up my bench, so I gotta be careful about doing that. So, to one shot at Charizard GX, I need all four. I wanna try to keep it at three, if possible, but you know, what, what can you do? So, we almost got the Charizard GX up. We don't have any energies this turn, nor do we have any retreats. Good thing I, uh, you know, good thing I, uh, you know, I kept uh, those float stones. Otherwise, I'd be a little mad right now. All right. So, moving back here. What's he doing? He's got it evolved. It's here now. Yeah. Interesting. Take full pie. What's full pie say? I always thought integrals have active members in comments, streams, Discord. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Thank you. Uh, thank you, full pie. He's gonna light Sander back to Charmeleon. No. No. It's out there. Does he have enough to get the one shot? DCE Charmeleon, you uh, you had lived a short life. Yeah, you got it, man. You got it. He gives us 110 damage. That's well, that'll be safe, but nope, not with a Lycanroc. 
So open up with a key on weight was a little risky. It was is extremely risky. However, well, we just we lose four energies. That is big. I lost four energies. I couldn't do anything about that. Uh, yeah, yeah. We can reshuffle them back, but for now, let's go for a two shot. Let's go for a two shot. Charizard is out now. I, of course, I'm gonna try to remove the choice band. And he is very low on cards. I don't mind. I can't get all the Charizard chicks up, so I'm gonna go ahead and play this right now. Do have another DCE. I think I have two shot potential as is. So let's go ahead and, you know, charge up our Charizard. That's all we can do for now. We got, we're missing a draw support. It's like, what did you discard your first turn? A bunch of cards. That's what you discarded. Half life it. So I only lost one prize card. The big thing I lost was the Kiawe energies. That was a complete waste. And what are these EVs here for? I think he has a Vaporeon to hit for weakness, which would suck. So his GX attack doesn't do much. All right, Verse Seeker again. You want the Charizard? No, you don't want the Charizard. He's more tame this time. So I wonder if he'll retreat. If he retreats, I'll get him. I think I'll still get him. Charizard won't get him. Charizard can use Rage out though. So if you get too close, on uh, I may just save him as a maybe a last final move. And I still, I still don't have my stadium. So we are really stuck on this time. We need a, uh, we need more stuff. Jolteon evolves into Lightning. I guess he's like Vaporeon's not here this time, or maybe Vaporeon and Jolteon are here, which would be bad. The thing is, is head for weakness right now. These guys are getting rotated. There is another Lycan Rock. He can pull the Charizard out, which is good for me if I have my Stadium. So will you pull the Charizard out? Yeah, I'll go ahead and bring that out, buddy. 130 damage, that is a two shot. That also has a strong energy. We also have a Guzma, so I think I will do that. I want to finish this off. I'm not gonna use a Rage Out or anything. We are gonna go ahead and retreat, send this out here. I should have enough. Finish that off. And we really need our stadium. We have four copies of the stadium. We actually need some draw. That's been a, that was a bit unfortunate. There we go. That's gonna, these Ultra Balls are gonna help out. Two prize Ultra Balls. Shame there, shame. Will Donald's ever merchandise ever be a thing? Maybe eventually, perhaps, perhaps. NTD says, good night mates, good luck Donald. Thank you, uh, NTD, uh, thank you. Don't trust the bitch Charmander either, says Charmander 91. I know, man. Oh, well, uh, with, uh, with the Lycan Rock there, but you can't trust anything these days. So as long as I don't fill up my bench, I'm still okay. All right, I've got actually, I'm actually winning on prize cards. That's, that, that's what strange as it is. So, there we go. I have this right now. If I retreat, I can probably get a one shot if I'm lucky. We'll figure, we'll figure about the retreat afterwards. Let's go ahead and sick more. I need more cards. All right, Charmanders. Charmanders, are you going to go for a rage out? Not really. Do you need more energies? Are you going to for a Crimson Storm? Probably not. Probably not. I could retreat and take a 50-50 right now to get a one-shot on that. I don't want a 50-50 right now, so I'm just going to use straight energy drive. There we go. Low risk, Donald, playing it safe. Well, I guess after next turn, I would have to do a 50-50 anyway. I probably should have done it. Although I would have lost the DC. It's just a DC. It's going to be fine. So, we got we got a halfway down. Could wing attack, but I would need a choice man. No, I have to go for a 50-50. I have to go for a 50-50 eventually, but maybe by that time I'll have uh, something else to uh, be useful with. Maybe I'll have my big thinny now. I had Ultra Balls. Had. That's the thing. So the Lycan Rock comes down. It's like, I wish I could Lysander this right now. In fact, do you actually have Lysander? Yes, you do. Lycan Rock and Lysander together. All right. Imagine a pad with a happy face that he puts this video. That'd be weird, wouldn't it? Can't let your deck get under 10. Rage Out is really clutch. So what is your playing? Are you playing? You're playing Sycamore. <laughs> That's four now. That is four. So, only a little bit more. All right, Lycan Lorak's going to charge up. We're going to have to deal with it eventually. So we're going to have two Charizards to fight with. Not me too bad. I lose Tapu Lele's. I've got to have a 50-50. So let's hope this 50-50 works. Otherwise, two wing attacks. I don't have a choice man. I need a choice man. Claw Flash. There it goes. My stadium is still up. He has Brooklyn Hill to remove it for now. I'm okay. Could rage out. All right, we got an Ultra Ball, which means we can't pull out Victini. I'm gonna—I'm not sure if I want to do that yet, but it's better than the Guzma. 
All right, let's go ahead and do this right now. Ultra Ball. Pull out Rangaroo Victini. I really want the Victini. I'll get two prize cards when I knock it out, but 75% chance is much more reliable. Much, much more reliable. Playful. Let's do this. Yes. No, I'll take that. 260 damage. Yes, your mini Torals. I get two cards. Bridge. Oh, I don't need those. I don't need those. Although I could... I could pretty, I could you combo this. I could combo this. So we're okay. We're okay. Vaporeon really wants that for the one shots. Oh, one shots. Come on. Come on. Are you getting close? Oh, rage out. Rage out. Rage out time. Give me the DCE. Give me the DCE right now. Give me the DCE. There is only six cards left in this deck. He's going to take away my float stone. So that's okay. Can you evolve? He really wants to go for the one shot. I really want a DCE. The DC with me. I have two DCs left in my deck. Uh, you didn't pull it, huh? Now this- you already played a Sycamore, didn't ya? Yeah! But he wants to play this anyway. Alright. He has one shot some- oh. No. Nope, Jolteon's gonna come out by some time. Because he did not pull the Lycanroc GX. How many, whoa, okay. That gives me extra time! Yeah! That means I get another free attack. But I- wait, I could just Rage out! I could just rage out! Rage out, GX! <laughs> you got no cards left in your deck. <laughs> oh, okay. Thinking too much. Thinking too much. I was thinking that Charizard was dead, which it pretty much was. I got lucky that he didn't get the Lycan Rat to evolve. And the Charizard was still around, so I could just rage out. That was that. It's like, oh, oh my gosh. I don't usually face Charizard. But when I do, that happens. Okay, okay. So that was awesome. That was amazing. Once to see that once. Once to see that. It worked. And welcome to another Charizard GX match. There's no Pokemon that can start with the bench. It's like, what are you waiting for? I'm going to play my remix of Cruel Angel's Thesis from Neon Genesis Evagalion. Now, Dark Ride GX, make it set up a one shot. Hex Maniac, Oh, oh, that means no Lele's or none of that, but that's okay. All right, Guzma and Charmeleon, you're the most uh, cards cards I can't use, so you must've been stuck if that was uh, your only move. Of course, now he can't one shot my Charizard GX, that's always scary, but this is our first turn. I don't want four energies in the Lele, that feels too much. So let's split it up. I'll put one energy on the Lele, and we'll key away all these golden energies. We have three fire energies left in our deck, so be careful with this, Donald. I don't know about that. If he Lysanders or do anything crazy, that would stink too. So, you know, I have Charmeleon here. I likely will use Charmeleon. It means he's going to be vulnerable for a turn. For a turn. So hopefully you stay alive. You definitely want to see Charizard GX because all the energies are there. So, it's, the, it's an investment. Hex Maniac to start off with, one energy. Okay, that's not too bad. Char Dark Rye. Aloy. Aloy. Is Alo isn't Aloy from, uh, I don't know her last name, but there was Aloy. Aloy's from a game that I know. All right. Easy first turn. We could, uh, I want an attack, so I want an energy. You seem stuck. Let me help you out. No, no, I'm going to go ahead and play end right now. And yeah, this may get you unstuck, but it may get me the DC to two-shot you. So I'm going to two-shot you. Fortunately, uh, we don't get a Charizard right now. So there's the DC I wanted. Energy Drive. This is the threat. And this is going to be a Charizard threat. But, mmm, two Goosebumps. That's why Burst Seeker is real nice. And all this around. So, first of all, thank you, Legendary Whale, MBM Sigma, Slide the Gamer for the follows. Hey, uh, the Gamer Shiko. I have a dream that will live to see your Infernate deck. Old style Infernape. That's a tough one to do, man. I don't know which turn. I think the latest Infernapes, they're a bit tough. They're tough because they get one shot and they only have two shots themselves, but it's really expensive to do. So, free retreats for this guy right here, waiting for my. Ch Let me get my Charizard, man. Hey, both Dark Rise are here. The EX version as well as the GX version. So. What are you gonna pull? You're probably gonna pull Shaman. Yep, there's the Shaman right there, as well as Tapu Lele. He wants the Lele. Maybe there's only one Shaman. So Shaman's gonna get rotated. So this deck, this deck's gonna need to get fixed up. 
You think Bunch of Dexter dead after rotation? No. I don't think so. I think Nine Tails is considered a budget deck, but it, the, the, it's definitely getting harder for those decks. So this is looking like a Dark Ride deck with the Dark Jar GX splashed in. I don't see what he has to use the GX attack, so I'm feeling safer now. Safer, but the fact that I don't have anything to evolve by Charmeleon is bad. How many supporters should be played? So yeah, one. You know, that's been happening occasionally, so I may add one more supporter after the end of the end of this video. So or end of this match. Just one, just one. Sometimes they're all there, sometimes they're not. We have a two. Sh oh, there's a draw of support. Speak of things, just when we're talking about you. Don't want to waste the DCs. Definitely don't want to keep that stadium. Don't want you to keep that stadium. I'll go ahead and load this to you. I'm gonna go ahead and end right now. He's missing an energy to attack me, which was got me pretty low. There's Charizard GX. Hi, Charizard. Let's go ahead and get you down there, man. Let's keep you safe. Charizard's out. He's ready to use, I mean, any of his attacks. So we have a two shot. We don't need to worry about anything else. Lele, the secret carry. The Coconut Master, you doing good there. Thank you for the follow up, BSJ Good. Now, what shall we do? Hello, Dark Ride. Uh, you don't, you don't, I don't see the many energies on your side right now, so he's got to do something to catch up. He sent the, he should have sent the evil toll out. And he's like, nope, I have a secret. I can use rest. That's kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of cool. So now I do have an energy. Now we can two shot each other. And what are you going to charge up? Dark Ride GX. No, I was wrong. I'm wrong. Choice man gets a two shot on me. And I got a two shot at it, so I don't really mind. Problem is Charizard, you know, I'll probably deny him from getting a prize card. I got Charizard GXL. Yeah, Charizard GX, even with a, I still need one more energy, but even with a Rage Out, I should be okay. So, XP share, setting up very nicely. Yeah, I gotta need, I only have one two room of one. Did I chuck it out? Oh, it's not there, it's still there. Thank you for the follow, Endrin Gao. Dark Ride be like, nope, I'm not gonna die. <laughs> this is this the game machine code. Still there, man. So do we have? No, we don't. We do have a one shot with an energy. I want a Sycamore at this point. No, I have Charizard GX right now, but I still want a Sycamore. I can do a hundred damage, so I need to do eighty somehow. Let's do this. Let's play a Sycamore. I'm okay. I maybe this. I, I was feeling regretting losing uh, the rare candy as well as Charizard, especially when Charmander's in your hand. So, all right, let's go ahead and Sycamore. I need the extra card pulls. Let's do it. This Rage Out. No, nope, Rage Out's doing nothing. There's that single fine energy I wanted. So is this? I don't think I could get two Charizard GX ups. You, you guys are all that's left. Let me give you the fire energy that you needed to attack. Let's go ahead and retreat right now. We do have a field blower, so let's go ahead and field blower. Look at those XP shares. He's like, no! He doesn't keep the two energy, so that, that's why he needed. Alright, so Guzma, keep Guzma around. I want to get the Charmeleon right now. Oh, there is no Charmeleon. Okay, they kinda, you kind of just threw cards, two cards away. I'll get one extra card instead. A bit of, that was, didn't know that was there. So let's go ahead and not use Rachel. Let's use Crimson Storm. Three energies discarded, so expensive. But now we're almost we're almost to the finish line. Oh, Victini was priced up. Good thing I got it. Good thing I got it. Take a look at my stadium counts. They're all in my deck. So if you get wounded enough, you can use your secret surprise attack. All right. So this is this is good. This is good. What anime is this? This is from Neon Genesis Evangelion. So you were anime guy. Good old, very uh well. Yeah, if you're an anime guy. From the past, you you, you get it. You, you notice, first seeker gonna play and gonna shrink my hands is zilch. Ah, oh, oh, that's gonna make it, this a bit riskier. And my energy counts are low too. So hey, Charizard, choice man. Don't worry. When you get end, Banana Master's gotcha. It's like you got me, Banana Master. That's nice. So what are we gonna do? We, we he hasn't got any prize because we've been hiding this Lele. Lele is like, don't send me out to fight. Choice ban, uh oh, gonna sting the Charizard. Oblivion, 50 damage. 
60 damage. Woo! That's yep. You been doing the math bit incorrectly. So, do I have another Lele? I've been looking at my deck, man. But I am gonna. Uh, nope, I do not have another Lele out. Oh, I do have another Lele. That's convenient. But before we Lele, let's go ahead and use some rank group. Oh, that's my last Lele. That's why you have three Lele. Expensive deck is already it is. 60 damage isn't gonna get me anywhere. However, I do have a Shana. I might just Shana instead of the Lele. Because I all I just really want is more cards. Good Guzman now, too. I want more cards. There's no reason to, to hold it in my hand. Let's go ahead and get more cards out. We do have more stadiums. That's good. Let's go ahead and use instead of use call for, for support. I am going to use... Call for support because I can't get a one shot on you anyways. Call for support. Bring Guzma here. Yeah, hey, Charizard. I'm going to get you up. So, uh, Guzma's here. I can send out Lele to get something out. So, uh, you, know, uh, you know what I'm trying to bait out. Yeah. He's gonna play N or something, because I have what I like in my hand. I still need another energy card to use Wing Attack or Rage Out, though. But he's getting closer to Rage Out. Getting, getting close. Would be nice to get another Charizard up, though. Although, that's a bit tough. A bit tough. Got another energy on. Got 190 hit points left. Still tough to finish this off one shot. Uh oh, gonna end again. He's like, no, I can't let him keep Guzma. Alrighty then. Guzma, how many Guzmas do we have here? Two, two left in the deck. You have a Rangaroo do? Yes, I do. Hey, Guzma! What you doing? What you doing? We can actually put... Really load up the Tapu Lele as well. So that's gonna give me five energies, perhaps. But I'm definitely, definitely gonna try playful. Hit me one more time, baby! <laughs> Hit me one more time! Thank you, Guzma. Thank you. Actually, the energy counts are looking high. He's got a choice man somewhere. Maybe it just... Oh, Marshadow! I want the Marshadow. There's no bench space for the Marshadow. I could almost rage out too. I could almost rage out. It'd be nice if I can get the Charmander. Very, very nice if I could. So you know what? I will get the Charmander up. Oh, energy scouts are a bit tough. All right, let's risk this. Let's use your secret attack, Charizard. Use your secret attack, man. So now I do 240 damage. All right, I, 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 I'm betting on you, Charmander. Guzma, bring out? It doesn't really matter, does it? But this is the lowest amount of hit points. So I'm gonna bring it out right now. Bring out the Rangaroo. And luckily that my stadium is still in play, let's go ahead and retreat. And you know, in case I get double tails or single tails, I still need that Victini. <gasps> Banana Master. Thank you. Thank you, Banana Master. Banana Master. Thank you. Thank you. Playful. Heads! No! Secret move, 240 damage. Banana Master, this is all you. Thank you. Thank you, Banana Master. I love you, Banana Master. I'm gonna owe you, Banana Master. Thank you, Banana Master. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. The Guzma came out when I needed it. The Vic Denny came out when I needed it. That was all top decks, baby. Thank you. Good game. Aloy, Bethan... Bethan... Bethanami. Okay. Woo. That was awesome. Wow. You're listening to this, and you've reached the end. And that is so. Thank you and congratulations. It is time we rate this deck. Let's break it down. Charizard GX, what makes you special? What makes you different from everybody else? Are you kidding? Look at all those numbers. 250, 300, five energies. Your stats are big and ridiculous. That what makes you crazy. So, let me break you down now. Damage. How, uh, how is your damage compared to other Pokemon? Let's see, 300 damage, one shot. One, uh, let's see, two energies, one shot, playful. You have two lethal damage attack, where both moves can one shot a Pokemon. Most Pokemon's only have one. He has two. Hmm, all right, I'm gonna give you an A. Give me an S. It's an A, it's top of the line. Reliability, are you reliable, Charizard? Because of your uh, five energy attacks? Because you need to evolve twice? Because you need a stadium in order to use that special powerful attack? 
which may be discarded, you need lots of stuff. Lots of energies, lots of evolutions. At the end of the day, you can still pull it off though. So the payoff is there. The payoff is an A. Get a big meaty Pokemon, big powerful damage. Once if you get it set up, great, great. If not, oh, well, yeah, that's that's the reliability. Reliably counts a lot. So the final rating is gonna be 3.5 out of 5. It's totally doable. You wanna make a Charizard GX work? Yes. They're up. Probably better GX card, so hey, don't give it up yet. Make this Charizard GX deck works, which you're gonna say, oh, you know what? Shrine of Memories is gonna be rotated. Can't use this anymore. You, oh, yeah. You can replace this with Celebi, which is gonna be printed real soon. Probably, actually, two months. It's gonna come out as a promo card, though. We'll replace this, so you will be able to use it in standard. You want to use expand it? No, that's that's easy. But that uh, all right. So anything else? Well, that's that uh, jars on. I think that's a good assessment. The next GX card we are gonna do next time is gonna be Galissopod GX, which is far more reliable. At least it's supposed to be. It's reliable. It's gonna be able to take on yeah biggest baddest cards out there. So Galissopod, this is a good investment, however. I like this guy. So, he's gonna be up for next time. Anything else? Um, there are gonna be more streams, more burning shadow cards, more updated cards, using the new burning shadow cards. So, <laughs> yes, there's a lot of Pokemon on the way, both on Twitch streams and YouTube. And you know, at this moment in time, I don't really have much to say. A new remix is, is on uh, iTunes and Spotify now, so definitely check that out. Um, don't forget to join my Discord. That's a special chat. You can talk to me. Uh, find me in the the Twitch. Uh, the people who join the Twitch stream uh, afterwards, after stream. I definitely should say that more often. I'm on Facebook. I'm on Twitter. I'm on Instagram now. So a lot of social medias. If you want to follow, find out what comes out next. I'm there. All right. Uh, that's. I think that's all we gotta say. Thank you very much, Integrals and the Frenchals. I will see you guys next time for Galissapod. Thank you and good night. It's not for me. Maybe not for you. Good night. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.